Hey everyone, welcome to this video. This is Raja from Charger Games. And in this video, I'm going to talk about a topic that comes into probably a lot of beginners' minds. Probably when you were starting in game development, this question came into your mind as well. And the question is, do you need a degree in game design to be a game developer or to work as a game developer? So we're going to talk about that and let's get started. So first thing I want to say is that when you were thinking about being a game developer, there are mainly three things that you can do. One, you can become a, you can become an indie game developer and work for yourself. Two, you can work for a studio or a startup or a big game studio, anything like that. You can work for them. And three, you can work as a freelancer game developer. So these are the three things that uh, you can do if you want to be a game developer. And I think that for any three of these, you don't really need a degree in game design. So why do people do degrees in game design? I'm not saying that they're wrong or something, but uh, if you want to do any three of these, a degree in game design or a degree in game development, anything like that is not a requirement. Uh, if you see that you want to be a lawyer, you want to be a doctor, in those cases, a degree in MBBS, or a degree in law is necessary but in this case you don't need to do anything in case of game design because most of the game developers that you see are indie game developers and they are self-learned they have uh, learned by themselves okay so what is the path that you should that you should choose if you want to be in the field of game development so the most recommended path and the path that i'm going to suggest is to get a degree in computer science so if you want to be a game developer, it's better to do your engineering and get a degree in computer science. And if you don't want to do engineering, that's fine. You can do a BS or VSC or MS or something like that. Anything that's related to the field of computer science uh, will be okay because there you're going to learn a lot about programming and all those stuff and a lot of different concepts that you will find useful in the field of game development. Now, in this case, I'm, most, I'm mostly talking about people who want to be programmers. I'm not talking about people who want to be 3D modelers or animators or something like that. So if you want to be a programmer or game programmer or game developer, then get a degree in computer science or information technology or a BS or BSc or MS or MSc, anything like that, anything related to computer science, it's going to be okay because there you're going to learn a lot of related stuff. Okay. And if you look the uh, careers page of any game design studio, any gaming studio, you go to eBay, not eBay, you go to EA and you go to Ubisoft or anything like that. In the career section, if you uh, take a look at the requirements of the jobs, you will see that for most of the jobs, you need a degree in computer science. Maybe you need a bachelor's degree in computer science, a BTEC or BE or BS or something like that. So if you uh, take a degree in that then that's gonna be most useful for you because uh, you can apply for those jobs and another useful thing is that many people when they are in college or when they're in school or when they're starting they think that they want to be a game developer but after when they graduate their uh, decisions actually change or when they don't get jobs in the field of game development then they think to switch careers or in a lot of cases, people when they join in the studios they don't want to work there for a lot of time and then they want to switch so in those cases as well if you have a degree in computer science then you can easily move into any other field that you want and i think i think that is really really necessary because at some point in time you really need to earn you really need to get a real job and that point of time you really need to get a job in a company that's stable and most of the game development startups are not stable okay so if you take my suggestions and uh, i want to say that whatever i'm saying is just my own suggestion so if you want to take a decision or if you want to do something make sure to ask from a lot of other people go to forums go to experts go to people who have taken jobs in this field and ask them uh, what are their opinions because this is just my opinion this is what i think but uh, other people may not think like this or you may not think like this if you think like me or if you take my advice then i will say that instead of getting a degree in game design if you want to be in this field get a degree in computer science and don't join a game studio as a job what i want to say is that be 
an indie game developer learn from the internet while you are getting your degree while you are getting your degree or bs or ms or anything like that learn from the internet there is youtube there is udemy there is linda there's thousands of thousands of uh, tutorials all over the internet so if you want to be a game developer just get your degree in computer science or anything or anything like that and while learning that learn game development and programming from the internet from youtube mostly and any from any other resource that you want and become an indie game developer okay and beside that i want you to get a job in a software company okay because those jobs are more stable compared to game developing jobs and they are more high paying and moreover if you join a game development studio the chances are that you will not be satisfied because you will have to do the same boring work that you have that you would have done in a software company okay you have to code you have to see you you cannot see the end result and something like that but if you work in a startup there you will work in a very small game and in that case you may have to do everything so in that case you may really enjoy but then again the pay will be very very less so uh my recommendation is to join a software company and build games by yourself become an indie game developer and publish them to google play store or steam or apple app store or anything like that so i hope you really like this video i made a video after a lot of days and i'm thinking of making a lot of videos like this where i will try to clear your confusions and the same confusions that i had when i started and the same confusions or questions that i received regularly so i hope you really enjoyed this video so thanks for watching if you really like this video make sure to hit the like button and uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel make sure to subscribe and if you want to take my courses and learn game development by building actual 3d and 2d awesome games then make sure to check the description because i will put all the links to my courses game development courses in the description a lot of people have taken the courses and built their first game published their first game and they have learned a lot so I uh, hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching and I'm going to see you in the next videos.